Hi, this is Bruce with Hunsaker Home Hacks. Please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for future notifications. So today, Anki has announced a few different things in updates. The first one is they're going to be working on the cliff detection sensors, and that's pretty cool. So hopefully he'll be able to come to an edge better and not roll on off or make himself roll off when he gets excited because he was at an edge. The other thing that they were talking about was pet detection. So they provided a link for you to send a picture of your pet. So if you do, it has to be taken with vector. So take the picture of your pet with vector and the pet detection will be uh, added to their queue of pets to detect. Yeah, there you go. The next thing is, let's talk about petting your Amazon Alexa. Now, you know I've been a big proponent of IFTT, but I'll be honest with you. This latest clip right here makes me very prominent on Anki's got the right idea on how to use the Amazon Alexa in Vector. It does look like it's a one command thing. You, hey Vector, and he goes to Vector, and you, Alexa, and he goes to Alexa. So, I'm gonna step aside while I pet my Alexa, and you can watch the video. Hey Vector, come here. Alexa, add avocados to my shopping list. Alexa, play speaker. Alexa, turn the heat up to 75 degrees. Alexa, turn on the stars. Alexa, set a reminder, Friday at 11 a.m. What's the reminder for? Doctor's appointment. Okay, I'll remind you Friday at 11 a.m. Alexa, how deep is Lake Tahoe? Depth is 1,645 feet. Alexa, turn the light green. Alexa, turn the light off. All right, so now you've seen Vector in action with the Amazon Echo feature. And it looks kind of good. It looks better than I was anticipating it to look. I was actually expecting a three phase, or at least a two phase, or three phase, I don't know. I was expecting you to ask Vector to ask Alexa, um, and it's not. It looks like it goes straight to Alexa or straight to Vector, which that is a good use. I mean, Vector knows, appears that Vector knows he is now accessing the Amazon Echo features. Um, and that's cool. So maybe it'll make petting Alexa a little bit more enjoyable than petting a hockey puck.
because this is a hockey puck. Just kidding. I like Alexa. She's one of my favorites. Matter of fact, I have a lot of Amazon products in my house. So, this is good. It looks better than I thought it was. It does. It's going to do home automation, which makes it even cooler. Uh, which, Alexa, has IFTT capabilities. So, that might be the workaround and even doing additional more with um, Vector and the Alexa integration. So maybe this isn't as bad as I was anticipating, which I'm very prominent. Now, so the Alexa integration, it looks pretty cool. I like it. I think it's going to be good, better than I thought. Uh, I want Vector to be Vector, and this seems to allow Vector to be Vector and also tap into the Amazon platform. And that's um, kind of a keen way of doing it. It looks a lot better than I thought. So I'm wondering what your thoughts are. So leave a comment below. My name is Bruce. I'm with Huntsaker Home Hacks. Please subscribe to the channel and ring the bell for future notifications. And I will see you soon.